sick of people telling me what to do. I'm sick of it. I just want to do what I want to do all day long, every day, until we're all dead. Show me cows. Step one, be in standard tuning. Step two, have a pick if you want. Step three, play the fifth fret on the top string for the hit song, Show Me How. Despite popular belief, I didn't write this song. Man, I trust wrote this song. Play the fifth fret on the top string. Great work. Play that note and count to two, and then very quickly, you're gonna pick up down on that same note. So we're going five, two, up, down. Uh, one, two, play it with me. And one, two, up, down. Great work. Now, with your pinky, play seven on the second string from the bottom. Play it, but then immediately slide up to nine. So keep the pressure against the string. Slide it on up to nine. Then play seven on the second string from the bottom. And then play five on the second string from the bottom. So here's what we have so far. Five on the top string. We're going one, two, up, down, slide, seven, five. Play it with me a little bit slower. Five, two, up, down, slide, and five. Great job, guys. Oh my goodness, I have to tell you two quick things. One, you can use your fingers and I think it's fine. That's great, if you're used to that, amazing. If But the bass player in the band does use a pick also, I believe he is slightly palm muting. He's taking this part of his hand and just very gently muting the strings over here, mostly the top two. If you don't palm mute the bottom two, it's, it's perfectly acceptable. When I listened to the recording, like the actual album version of the song, I was like, oh, clearly he's just playing the bass normal. And then there's an electric, normal electric guitar playing the part along with them and that's why it has that special attack but then in live videos that does not appear to be the case it appears to be the case that the bass player is handling this all on his own using a pick and palm muting so there you go mystery solved guys i knew you could do it gumshoe we're learning the intro right now by the way and it's getting very sweaty in this room let's play it from the beginning one two six go five two up down slide and five hook. You hold this note out for two beats. You just count to two. Then you play seven on the second string from the bottom with your pinky. Then you play five on the second string from the top with your pointer finger. But right as you play this note, you slide up to seven. And then you go right back and play five. So that was just great. So it was seven, slide, five. Then on the second string from the top, play three then back up to five, and then jump all the way down to one on the top string. That last little stretch was two, just play that with me. One more time, cause you're not quite getting it. Five, six, go. Three, four, I'm confused. How'd you do? My count off was fine. I think that you just don't know the part well enough. Uncle Stewart, this is too many notes. Yeah, I know. Oh well. Let's play uh, everything from the beginning. One, two, and three, and a four, and a five, two, up, down, slide, seven, five, two, and uh, 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 uh. Great work. So you're on this one right here. You're gonna to count to two. That's kind of the theme of the show, is you play a note, you hold it out for two beats, then you play some more notes, then you hold out a note for two beats, play some more stuff. So we go one, then after you count to two on this first fret, you're gonna play up down on that same note. Play three on the top string with your pinky and immediately slide up to five. Then play three on the second string from the top. Then play five on the second string from the top and slide up to seven. How are we doing? That last part there was bum, 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 slide, three, slide. Play it with me from the first fret. One, two, 
up, down, slide, three, slide. Ah! Uh, you hold this note out for like a beat, and then you play five on the second string from the top, and then you play three on the second string from the top. <sighs> Look, if we're being completely honest, I didn't realize this song had so many notes in it when we started. Starting from the first fret, we've got one, two, up, down, slide, three, slide, five, three, okay. Then play three on the second string from the top again, slide it up to five, then play seven, and then play three, five. One, two, up, down, dump, bump, 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 bump. I think you did great. We're almost done with the intro, I promise. Just take it from the first fret part one more time, nice and slow. One, two, here we go. Now one, two, go, go, slide, three, slide, boom, boom, bam, boom, bam. Great. Okay, now at this point, we start everything over. So we go back to the fifth fret on the top string. We play everything exactly the same. Look, we go five, ba, bum, bam, bum, bum. But then, at this point, things change. So the first time we went one, 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 thrum, bum, and we did all the sliding and everything. This time, when we get to the first fret, we just go like this. One, up, down, three, five, six. So it's just one, 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 three, five, six. And we hold this out for four beats, and that's the entire intro. Let's play the intro all the way through. I have faith in you, just have courage. Let's do it. One. Two, here, a little slower. Come on, Stuart, chill out. One, two, and nice and slow. And five, two, up, down, slide, seven, five. Whoop, seven, slide, five, three, five, one. Huh. Start it over. We've done it. It's time for the verse. I have to tell you that the verse is similar to the intro. The verse is sort of like a simplified version of the intro. Check it out. Start on five. We go five, up, down. So it starts off exactly like the intro. Top string, fifth fret, one, two, up, down. Then just play that fifth fret again. Then play three on the top string. Then play three on the second string from the top. Watch. One, two, Three, four, five, up, down, five, three, three. Two, okay. Hold that third fret out for two beats. Then on the second string from the top, you're gonna play three, three, five. So that was pointer, pointer, pinky. Play the fifth fret again, but slide it up to seven. So now we've got bum, 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 bum. Then jump back to three on the second string from the top and then play one on the top string. So that whole part there was three. Ba -bum 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 -bum. Guys, let's play the verse from the beginning. We're not quite done with it, but we're getting there. From the beginning of the verse, here we go. And five, two, up, down, five, three, three. Uh. Great work. Now, once we get to this first fret, then we just play the first fret part of the intro. Do you remember that? It's where we went like Do you remember? Like, do you kind of remember? Do you remember enough where I don't have to teach it to you again? Look, I'm gonna talk through it real quick. We just go one, two, up, down, slide from three up to five. Then you play three on the second string from the top. Then you play five on the second string from the top, slide up to seven. Then play five, then three, then you play three again, slide up to five, then seven, then three, five. I know, it was way too fast for even me to understand it, so how could you possibly understand it? It doesn't matter, because all you have to do is remember that part of the intro. I feel like I'm just saying numbers. I'm just telling you phone numbers. 415-89... I should not tell you my parents' phone number. Do you want to know my phone number? 415. That's just, that's all I'm gonna tell you. 
41589. That's it. I'm just giving you the first five digits. People of the world, friends and relatives, I really am hating this. I love playing this song, but this is a miserable experience and I just, I just want it to be over. We just finished the main riff for the verse. We just have to play that twice in a row. Should we try it? Let's try it. One, two, karate chop, Rochambeau. Five, two, up, down, five, three, down. Da -da. Great. See, that's all there is to it. Easy as pie. We've made it to the second half of the verse, also known as the pre-chorus. Guess what the pre-chorus is? I'll tell you. The pre-chorus is literally exactly the intro 100%. You just play the intro again. But then after that, we're at the chorus. The chorus is a whole other thing. I don't want to learn it. You don't want to learn it. Behold, the chorus of Show Me How by Men I Trust. On the top string, play the fifth fret, just like every other section of the song starts. You just play down, down, up, down. Hey! And down, down, up, down. Then go to the second string from the top and play five, seven, eight. So now we have five, five, up, down, five, seven, eight. Great work. Hold this out for two beats, approximately, sort of. Then you play eight on the second string from the top again. Then you play up, down on the eight. So it's eight, eight, up, down. Then play seven on the second string from the top. Then three on the second string from the top. And then five on the top string. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Uncle Stuart, you can't possibly be thinking I'm keeping track of this. I can possibly be thinking anything I want to. Chorus, nice and slow, here we go. And five, down, up, down, five, seven, eight. Eight, up, down, seven, three, five. At this point in time, go to five on the second string from the top and play down, down, up, down. Then play seven on the second string from the top and then play eight and then go back to seven. So that was to play it with me here we go and five 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 seven eight seven then wait then you're gonna play seven up down we're basically that's a rhythm we're doing throughout the chorus as we're playing ba, ba, up down it goes like down down up down boom bang gong bang ba bang gong gang gong gong ba dong gong gang gong play it from the very beginning of the chorus with me one Two, we're almost done with this. Five, down, up, down, five, seven, eight, eight, up, down, seven, three, bum, 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 bum. Great. On this seven, we're playing seven, seven, up, down, down. Okay? I know I just played up, but I said down. Do as I say, not as I do. Do as I please. I'm sick of people telling me what to do. I just want to do what I want to do all day long, every day, until we're all dead. Can I tell you something? I love taking showers. If it's a great refreshing feeling. If it's super hot out, you take a cool shower. If it's cold out, you take a hot shower. It's incredible. Yet guess what? Every day, all day, I dread taking my shower. I'll be like eating breakfast and I'll go, ah, oh, crap, I have to take a shower tonight. I, it makes no sense in the comments. What's wrong with me? What's wrong with you? Because I think you feel the exact same way. I mean, not you, but you do. Every This whole thing, this whole thing is what a disaster. I, I'm not talking about the song. I'm not talking about the video. I'm just talking about this whole thing. This whole entire thing. That last part of the chorus, we're on seven of the second string from the top. We go down, down, up, down, down. So it's down down, up, down, down. Then you play the top string open and then you start the whole chorus over again. No one, this doesn't make any sense to anybody. Look, we're gonna play the whole chorus all the way through. So you play everything we just learned and then you play it all again. We're gonna do it slowly. Just watch my fingers, do whatever you gotta do. One, two, three, four. And one, two, ba-bum, bum, bum, bum. Eight, 
that seven on the second string from the top you just hold it out you hold it out for four beats it's actually like four and a half beats but no, nothing matters anymore no okay so then after the chorus which you did a great job you've really learned it i'm really impressed then you do the interlude it's just exactly the same as the introduction then we go to the second verse for the second verse you just play the first half of the first verse and then you play the first half of the pre-chorus, all right? Then we get to the bridge of the song, which, oh, I can't believe it. It's a whole other part of the song. We have to learn a whole other thing. Literally no one is gonna learn this bridge part, but I will yell the notes at you anyway. The bridge, which comes right after the second verse, is you play the first fret on the top string. You go down, two, up, down. Great work. Then you play three on the top string. Then on the second string from the top, play three and slide up to five and then play three on the top string. It goes like this, one, two, up, down, three, slide three. Play it with me. One, two, up, down, three, slide three. Great. You hold this one out for approximately two beats and then you play up, down on the third fret, then play five on the top string, then three on the second string from the top, back to five on the top string. So that was three, ba da bum ba bum so far for the bridge, we have one, two, up, down, three, slide, three, two, up, down, three, slide, three, great. Now, you play five on the second string from the top, hold it out for approximately two beats, one, two, then play on the second string from the top, five, five, seven, eight, seven. Just like that, here we go. And five, two, up, down, five, bam, bam. Hold this one out, the seventh fret on the second string from the top for about two beats, play up down, and then play the seven on the top string, then open top string, then three on the top string. So it's ba, ba -da -ba -ba -ba. play it with me. Seven, up down, sevens, open three. And then you repeat all of that one more time. And that's the bridge. Can we please try playing the bridge together as a family? One, two, please just try it. One, two, ba bum bum slide three. And three, three, ba ba do five. Ba bum 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 bum. One, two, seven, seven, top, open three. We'll start it over. Great work! We've made it to the chorus, the second chorus. Guess what? It's exactly the same as the first chorus. Then we have make it to the ending of the song. Shoot, darn it, it just never ends. It just never ends. Oh wait, no, the ending's fine. Look, on the second string from the top, you just play nine, nine, eight, eight, seven, seven, six, six, five. Wait, 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 seven. Hold it out. Uh, let's play that together. It's just nine, nine, eight, eight, seven, seven, six, six, five, seven. One, two, here we go. And nine, nine, eight, eight, seven, seven, six, six, five. Wait, wait, and seven. Then you go back to the intro one final time and you do the full intro the boom we're not we're not gonna play through the whole song you've got to be kidding me there's no way that's happening i've spent too much time on it so i can't delete it i have to upload it i have no choice i'm being forced against my will watch this pretty cool right 